Stay patrol. Let's show you being audio and video recorded right now. And we're going to stop because it looked like you were almost going to crash a couple of times behind me there. What's going on? Headed to your boyfriend's house? Where's that at? Up here in Federal Way? Oh, in Olympia. Okay. All right. All right. How much you had to drink tonight, Miss Wells? A couple. A couple of what? A couple of wine. Okay. Just glasses or... Okay. All right. Well, what I would do right now is give you an uh, opportunity to do some voluntary field sobriety tests to make sure you're good to keep going or not. Would you be interested in doing that? Okay, go ahead and step out of the car for me. To the front of the car. Why that? You can turn off fuel. Yeah. Save the gas. Yeah. Come to the front here. Okay. All right. You all right? All right, go ahead and stand right here for me. Were glasses contact or anything? No. Were got any problem with your back? You need your legs? Anything to prevent you from doing I've tests? Had, I've had three back surgeries. Three back surgeries? Yes. Do you think it would prevent you from doing tests? or? I don't think so. Okay. Well, we, we can see and you can let me know, okay? Okay. Do you tip my pen right here? Yes. Why don't you follow through my pen with your eyes only? Don't move your head, okay. all right? All right. Don't oh, move your head. Just sorry. drive. So this next test is called uh, the walk and turn. So what we're going to do is we're going to pretend that there's an imaginary line right here. Okay, you can even use that black line. Is that black okay. line right there? Okay. Right. Go ahead and push your left foot on that black line. Okay. And with the, the, the back of your right foot, touch the toe of your left foot. Stay in that position with your arms down to your side until I tell you to begin. When I tell you to begin, what you're going to do is you're going to take nine heel to toe steps down the black line here. Turn around and take nine heel to toe steps back. And I'll demonstrate for you what I need you to do. When you're doing it, huh? What you're gonna do is you're gonna you're gonna look down at your feet, count your steps out loud so I can hear it. So it's gonna look okay. like this: one, two, three. Now I'm only gonna take three steps. Remember, you'll take nine. nine. When you get to that ninth step, leave that front foot planted, and with a series of small steps, get yourself turned back around. Back down the line. So eight two, total. Three. Right. And, and you okay. look down, look down at your feet, and count the steps out loud so I can hear it. All right. Once you begin the test, don't stop until you completely finish. Understand all that? Okay. So nine back, or nine there, and nine, nine back. back. Right. Eighteen. Eighteen. Okay. Whenever you're ready. One, two, three, four, 
Put your feet together and your arms down your side. Stay in that position until I tell you to begin. This next one's called the one leg stand. Okay. So what you're going to do is when I tell you to begin, you're going to pick one foot, either one, your choice. You're going to lift it approximately six inches off the ground just like this, parallel to the ground. Keep your um, your legs straight, arms down your side. And what you're going to do is you're going to look down at that raised foot and count just like this. 1,001, 1,002, 1,003, and so on until I tell you to stop. Okay? Okay. If at any point during the test, if your foot hits the ground, just bring it right back up and start counting from where you left off. Okay. Do you understand all that? So, I'm going to lift one leg up off the ground, about six inches shot. Right. And I'm going to count 1,001, 1,002. Right, while looking down at the raised While foot. looking down at the, at the foot that I've raised. Right. And if I need to put it down, I put it back up, and I start where I left off. Right. Okay. Got it? Okay. Yeah. Go ahead and begin now. Alright, go ahead and stop. Okay. Alright, go ahead and turn around for me. Okay. Alright. You are under arrest for DUI. Alright. Okay. Is it is it your van or someone else's? Yeah. Well, the car. Is it yours or is someone yeah. someone else's? Yours? So you're the registered owner? Yeah. Oh, okay. One in custody, DUI, storm your toe. One in custody, DUI, one in I'm going to double lock these so they're not too tight on you here. Alright. Let's go this way first. There's not much room to get by on the other side there. Right. Is there anything on you that's going to poke me, stick me, anything like that? No. Guns, knives, no. bombs, bazookas? No? Alright. No, I'm a good girl. You're a good girl. Alright. All right. Go ahead and stop right here for me. Go ahead and stretch your feet for me. There you go. Smoke and lighter. Just smoke. The lighter. Yeah. Okay. Chapstick. Okay. Any inside pockets on your coat here? No. No. Okay. Well, you don't need to apologize to me. Well, but, well, you know, I'm sure because I could look at my rearview mirror and I thought you almost crashed twice in the barrier there. Alright, let me have a seat for me. Watch your head getting in. There you go. Alright. When I'm going to do right now, I'm going to read your constitutional rights, alright? You have the right to remain silent. You have the right this time to an attorney. Anything you say can and will be used against you in the court of law. You have the right to talk to an attorney before answering any questions. You have the right to have an pre uh, attorney present during the questioning. If you can't afford an attorney, one will be appointed to you without cost if you so desire. You can exercise these rights at any time. You understand these rights? No. Okay. Is this the most current address for you in Monroe? 168. 168 Yeah. That's where you live right now. Okay. Yeah. All right. Sit back for me. Then.
be the RO, uh, 